like five reasons why you should not develop AI software for your business. We'll be examining this again from, from two opposing viewpoints. And just get ready for a stimulating debate. Get a, get a sense of, of where we're at. So we're going to cover these five reasons. Reason number one, high initial costs. Developing AI software is expensive. The costs of hiring specialized talent, acquiring powerful hardware, and the sheer time investment required make it prohibitively expensive. This can be expensive for most businesses already struggling with cash flow. While this may be true, AI development can be costly. It's important to remember the long-term return on investment. AI can dramatically improve efficiency, reducing errors, and provide insights that can lead to significant cost savings over time. But many businesses, especially smaller ones, simply can't afford that initial investment. They might go bankrupt or suffer cash flow uh, constraints before they ever see those long-term benefits. And this is a valid concern. However, there are ways to mitigate these costs. Companies like Glorium Technologies offer AI development services that can be a lot more cost effective than building an in-house team and having in-house infrastructure. Plus, cloud computing has made powerful hard hardware more accessible than ever. Reason number two, lack of expertise. AI is an incredibly complex field. Many businesses just don't have the in-house expertise to develop effective AI solutions. They're more likely to create something that, that doesn't work properly or worse, it even makes bad decisions. Uh, so even though this may be a complex topic, that's ex precisely why many businesses partner with specialized AI development firms. These companies have the expertise to develop effective AI solutions tailored to specific uh, business needs, but taking their specific requirements into account. Okay, but what if you have an outsourced development, so you still need in-house expertise to effectively implement and use the AI without having to waste money on a tools that you don't even understand. And this is really one of the challenge points. And the, the need for in-house understanding is, is a requirement. However, reputable uh, AI development partners don't just deliver a product and walk away. They often provide training, documentation, ongoing support, and ensure that businesses effectively use and maintain their AI solutions. A major issue, reason number three, data privacy and security concerns. AI systems require vast amounts of data to function effectively. This creates huge privacy and security risks. What if your AI system gets hacked and sensitive customer data is leaked? The reputational damage could be catastrophic to any business, small or large. You know, data security is, is cr critical, but it is not a problem unique to AI. Any digital system needs robust security and security measures. Reputable AI developers prioritize, prioritize security and comply with regulations like GDPR and HIPAA. AI systems, however, are particularly vulnerable because they often require access to so much data. Plus, the complexity of AI <clears throat> Uh, systems can make it harder to identify and fix uh, problems and this is a this is a big thing the the data is amounts are so large can be can also mean that we have to de design systems with the the, the mass data in in, uh, in taken into account and making sure that we are able to enhance the cybersecurity and detecting and responding to threats more quickly than humans can. And this is a, an advantage of AI. What about ethical concerns and, and biases? You know, AI systems can, ha you know, they, they perpetually amplify <laughs> existing biases, leading to unfair discriminatory outcomes. They could result in legal issues and damage your company's reputation. We've seen law firms uh, produce results that don't exist. You know, the bias um, that, that does happen 
is being actively uh, addressed. And responsible AI development inclu includes rigorous testing for bias and making use of, of, of maximizing training data. And even with the best intentions, it's almost impossible to eliminate all bias. And when AI makes decisions, it's not always clear how it arrived at those decisions, making it hard to identify where the bias comes from and even to correct it. So this, this may be a, an issue right now to, to have complete elimination of, of bias. However, with AI, an AI able to detect and mitigate human biases, it can increase the transparency. And also, the, through the explainable AI techniques, companies like Glorium Technologies can prioritize ethical AI development and can help businesses navigate these complex issues. Reason number five, rapid technological change. The field of AI is evolving so rapidly and any AI software you develop, the risks are becoming obsolete because just as you develop, the AI has come up with improvements. This means you've, in, you've invested money and your output is already outdated by the time you start using it. You know, AI is indeed a fast-moving field, and, and, <laughs> and that's the reason why you need to start developing right now. Companies that wait risk falling behind um, uh, uh, to their competitors. Okay, but how can we can businesses keep up keep up the pace with the change? And it seems like this never-ending invest, investment and with no real guarantee of, of returns. And this is really why partnering with development firms, AI development firms, can be uh, d beneficial. They stay on top of the latest developments and then can help with continuously updating and improving AI systems. It's not just about developing a static product, but about building adaptable AI capabilities that can involve and, and evolve with your business needs. So let's draw a conclusion. It is a fascinating discussion of AI, and it's really a, AI that comes with significant challenges, and, and it is also tremendous potential benefits for businesses. As with any major technological investment, careful consideration of your specific needs and circumstances is crucial. Thanks for tuning in again to Tech Decisions, and until next time, may your tech choices be wise ones.